Ramage Lewis reporting for Cadred.org. I'm here at the Epic Six Land at Utoxita Race Course, and uh, as is customary for the website, I'm going to kind of give you a tour so you can see what you're missing if you haven't been able to attend. Just follow me through. Well, look at that for a good bit of time. I believe this is a slimline Joe Risky. If you can believe it, he's actually lost eight stone. Uh, that's HIV for you. It's pretty. Uh, no, I'm just kidding. Don't make jokes about that, we'll take that very seriously. Good to see you though. And uh, no, this is Bash, we'll probably be interviewing him a little bit later on. He's actually got the weight that Joe lost. It's, it's kind of a symbiotic relationship we've got. That's pretty good. Although he actually got muscle. But anyway, this is a, yeah, the Epic Six Lab. Uh, you talk to the race course. Uh, you probably here over here. In fact, I'll take you in this hole first because this is the one where we've had DJ Super Chief, which you may have read a bit about. Uh, he's been playing some kind of Stuff. I don't know why you'd want this really while you were playing games, but they do some dream hack as well. There's obviously a much, much smaller one. I'll take you in, just kind of here. And the people playing, this is more the sociable uh, side of it rather than the tournament side of it. You can see over here you've got quite a large bar. Um, and just come over here. So yeah, this, way. this is where all the uh, admins and kind of people are living in this section, sorting out people's uh, games and stuff. Anyway, the music's absolutely horrible, so I'm just going to uh, get out of here before I kill myself. This is the uh, main part. We've got shops that sell everything that a uh, good game needs that's caffeine, sugar, and fat. And that's pretty much all you're going to subsist on uh, for, for uh, a land. Um, so that's good. Very, very popular with me. You should probably tell about my physique. Uh, don't, don't bag me on uh, camera, thank you. That's uh, some of the lads from the Rasta Mix there. Here we've got a few exhibitors. Not, not a great deal, but um, you know you can see it's been set up quite nicely here. Um, thermal take as well, which have been making great strides in the kind of eSports community you've come down and been forced. There, there was a, a little kind of stand here that they've got. This is one of the guys here, this is Andrew Christopheru, who's kind of the... Uh, you, what's your official title? You Euro can, European marketing. European marketing manager in eSports community. Uh, this, this, this was the guy that they didn't want to talk to in ESL. So we'll, uh, <laughs> but we're going to interview him as well, so we'll talk about that later. Obviously this is uh, the guy as well, say hello to all the people at the camera. Hello, Cadre, uh, it's your uh, so happy to see us. <laughs> this is the uh, admin area as well, you can see it's it's all the very, very hard, hard to figure out area. I mean, you can probably see source TVs, they're, they're, they're out in force, probably it's ruining everything they're doing while they're on air and <laughs> with all the big microphones and stuff. But we're uh, going to be kind of doing some work with them as well. I'm going to be interviewed on there tomorrow. They're cool, they're pr pretty good guys, they even lent us some batteries. So. They're in my uh, good books. Now if you come down to the players area, you can see, look at all this excitement in the crowd. GLG, always got a big fan base. There's uh, Jack List and Mason there, games, sourced. It's very exciting. So uh, if you come down here, I'll take you right down to the other end. Yeah, not really much to see. You can see you know, some screens up. And, uh, Come right down, I believe. Who have we got down here? Rasta. Sort of go past earlier. Uh, Linker there as well. well. That's pretty much about it. I'd like to kind of pad it out, but it's not really a big land. It's not that kind of event in terms of the number of people that are here. You're talking maybe 80, uh, you know, to 100 uh, if you include specs. Maybe a little bit more. But um, just because it's a small event doesn't mean that it can't be competitive. Already we've seen a lot of games, we've had a, a lot of upsets uh, and results that have kind of been quite close and it's still in the group stages so the, the knockout stage and the bracket should be very interesting. But anyway, hope that tour has given you a little bit of an insight into what the event's all about. But do stay tuned to Cadred where we're going to have more video content, more interviews, all the latest scores and results from here in Utoxida at Epic 6.